Imagine a typical British countryside scene, and you might think of a patchwork of carefully managed, well-ordered fields, neat hedgerows and tidy rivers, a sense of nature tamed. With the loss of so much British wildlife, the time has come to let nature off the leash, give natural processes space, and who better to welcome back than the original landscape artist, the beaver. Weighing up to 30 kilograms, around the same as an 11-year-old child, they're Europe's largest rodent. They live in rivers and streams, and unlike their rabbit and squirrel relatives, they spend the majority of their time in the water. And they're brilliantly adapted to this lifestyle, with a strong paddle-shaped tail, webbed feet, waterproof fur, and they can hold their breath for up to 15 minutes underwater. A beaver's most important feature is their large, bright orange front teeth, protected with an orange iron-filled enamel to strengthen and prevent tooth decay. They use these strong, sharp teeth to coppice trees for food and dam building. By building dams out of mud, sticks, stones, logs and vegetation, they create deep ponds protecting themselves from predators. Beavers also create networks of canals, providing safe access to new food and building materials, which they can then float back to their dam. All this hard work creates an extraordinary mosaic of watery habitats. A beaver's home is called a lodge. This is where they nest, with underwater entrances and exits and layers of insulating mud, they're safe from predators and the cold. Beavers have been extinct in Britain for around 400 years due to hunting for their fur, meat, medicine and perfume. With the continued taming of our landscapes during this time, restoring beavers to their previous locations is a challenge, potentially affecting those that live and farm the land nearby. There may be special trees people don't want coppiced or wetlands created in the lowlands where floodplains are farmed. However, these challenges can be overcome with proper management and collaboration to allow some of the amazing benefits of beavers for humans. One of the most exciting effects of beaver dams is to slow the flow of rivers and streams. Water is held back by the leaky dams, so it can be stored during droughts or during heavy rainfall, water can be released slowly, reducing the risk of floods downstream. With slower water, sediment sinks and algae and plants are supported. Thus, beaver ponds start to absorb more carbon dioxide, helping to mitigate climate change. Equally importantly, the rich wetlands created are rare in our landscapes and we need to find space for more because they provide essential homes for many types of wildlife some of which are currently endangered. It's because of these impacts on the landscape that beavers are known as a keystone species. They create the conditions that support abundant life along our rivers, including frogs, brown trout, kingfishers, the endangered willow tit, dragonflies, bees, otters and bats. If we can welcome back these quiet bringers of change and learn to live alongside them and their impacts, we can let our rivers flow more naturally again allow space for nature to thrive and for the countryside to be restored to the rich and colourful landscape which is full of life once more. <laughs>